Halloween banner swappers and friends. We have yet another beautiful banner to open here. And I just have to say that you guys are really stepping up on the packaging because everything that I have opened has just been amazing. And I am just so impressed with everybody's talent and your attention to detail. It's just great. So this one comes to us from Raquel also known as a crafty diva designs on Instagram and she has created four packages and I love this bag. I have the smaller version of these, but I didn't I didn't think that I would need the bigger size, but you know what? I think I need this bigger size as well. So it's it's perfect. So she has created four and for, so that I can open one and I have picked one. And to some of you, it will be no surprise that I picked the very purpley one. Um, but first, let me show you. Um, she had this nice little uh, note for me. It says, pick your poison. Of course, my name. And look at this cute card. It says, oh, my goth. And it's a little goth girl. And the coloring on that, if you did the coloring on that... That is just amazing. Whoever colored it. You, uh, factory, but whoever did. It is it is on point and perfect. I, I love it. Um, and there's a it's a sequin um, mixer mix inside there and a tag and and she left it blank, which is just so appreciated, but I'm not using that card. It's going to go in my collection and it's perfect. So thank you so much Raquel for that. And I have chosen this bag right here. She has her information on the back and um, I love that you put that it's for the Halloween banner swap posted by the spotted owl. I love that detail and let's break into this. And so this is, I think, I'm not sure if that's a sticker or from a, a kit, but it's so cute. Black tie bones elixir. I love that a little mustache. Isn't that cute? So cute. Um, it's all the little details. Oh, look how cute. This little ghosty stir stick. That is so cute. Can you see that? <laughs> that is cute. Uh, let's set that aside. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love it. Okay, so let's start with her. These are her extras, I believe. Because we have a... So uh, the assignment was to include two, um, two to three extra ephemera pieces. And she chose to create this. That is so cute. A memory dex. With your information. Love that. That is so cute. And look how cute and adorable this is. That skeleton is so cool. I love that. That is really cool. Trick or treat. Smell my feet. Give me something good to eat. Oh, so scary. Sticker. Hocus Pocus. That's my absolute favorite thing. I actually say it all year because I work with kids. Um, and we say, I say, Hocus Pocus. And then the children reply everybody focus. So it's a commonly used phrase um, every day for myself. Um, love the purple bat, of course. And I love how you made the skeleton, you know, go behind and in front. That is very creative uh, design element. And that is going to go right into my memory decks holder. That is perfect. Thank you so much for that. Um, and then this cutie, look how cute. Oh my goodness. I'm in love with that bat. <laughs> you guys look how cute. <laughs> oh my gosh. that I think that is the cutest thing I have seen in a long time. That is so cute. It makes me giggle. <laughs> and a spider web and a little rosette and a, a little tag. And there's even a layer of candy corn paper and it's a bag topper. 
that is just perfect and that makes me smile that makes me smile so sweet and oh look a, a cute witch fabulous uh clothespin that's cute Ooh, and a fun bag that feels like vellum Ooh, did you make that bag that is really cool that's a cool cool paper and i'm gonna get it i'm gonna get it hopefully i don't rip the bag because i want to reuse this bag how oh, cute Ooh, la la oh that is clever that's clever that washi tape um pumpkin i'm just gonna it it will rip but it will be okay oh my gosh look how adorable oh my heck where did you get these beads those are so cute what uh, they these are wood beads let me hold it a little bit closer these are wood beads a shoe uh gumball beads i call them these feel like wood i wonder if you painted those yourself and a cauldron sorry i have to think of the word um i like to call these um gumdrop beads because it reminds me of the gumdrop sugar i think that's what some people call them oh i love that is clever putting some little hashi beads on the bottom to keep it from going in very clever oh i see a skeleton and some candy maybe i don't know but it's cute let me put that behind that's cute if that helps i'm not sure that helped um Oh, look how cute. Ooh, a black ghosty. So cute. Ooh, and I really do love these. I love the purple gumball bead. The polka dots. Oh, it's just perfect. Raquel, great job on the dangle. Love it. It's perfect. Oh, per oh my gosh, look at that. It's a, a candy with a skeleton not skeleton jack-o-lantern face on it oh so tiny can i hold it can i hold it by the camera mm, this way this way <laughs> sorry <laughs> oh heavens to betsy that's cute <laughs> oh gosh <laughs> it's been a long day um but that is perfect i love the colors purple orange black white and some green it's perfect great job Raquel and look at this beauty oh it's adorable I love this I love that image that is perfect and a little um, die cut um, haunted house um, a little poison there's a, a fence back here like a rickety fence on some cool paper and she has used um, a scallop shape oh and you put that on there that's great i love that um a scallop shape banner piece and the attachment straw i was hoping that a lot of you guys would um follow my lead on the straw and if you didn't that's great too it doesn't really matter but i know that a lot of people have mentioned that they have never they never would have thought to put a straw there i just you know that's i i, I can't remember where i saw it. i somebody saw somebody do it and I thought that's a great idea. And so that's what I do whenever I need to hang something um, like that. Um, banners, of course. So thank you so much, Raquel. It is so spectacular. See what I did there? Spectacular. And I absolutely appreciate everything that you did and created. And thank you so much for participating. And thanks for stopping by, friends.